Hey guys, it's Chris Kringle here, and welcome back to more Pokemon Red, where creepy music lies in Lavender Town. We made it to Lavender Town last episode. We fought our rival in the Pokemon Tower, the good old soul or resting place of the dead Pokies, Pokemans. Uh, and this time, before we move on to our next destinations, I'm just gonna check out this tower for a sec just to show off some things. So, uh, you remember how I said that we weren't gonna do it? Well, I'm gonna show you why, hopefully, at least if I remember correctly, on what happens if you try to do this. Let's talk to this lady. Even we could not identify the war ward ghosts. A sylph scope might be able to unmask them. By what she's talking about, it looks like we would need something called a sylph scope to be able to uh, traverse through this place. So, looks like we might have to uh, avoid this place for the time being. Uh, no problem, you know, creepy graveyards of Pokemon. But anyway, look at this nice green pastures again. Let's start with these battles. Oh, round cute fluff Pokemon, I love them. Ah, battles. Lass wants to fight Clefairy round and fluffy. I don't even know if it has fur, but you know. Okay. Thunderbolt, how much does this do now? Great. <laughs> uh, I love it. I l -l 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 love it. But you know, I probably should con conserve my. Thunderbolts a little bit just so I don't run out of them quicker, but you know how it is. And sign. What? That didn't kill? Oh, come on now. You try to growl me, girl? You don't do that. Uh. I'm not sure how long I'll play out this episode, because I don't remember how long the route is. I don't know if I want to put it all in one part. I feel like that might be a bit more better constructive, but also it might be just too much for me to cram in and stuff. I feel like, I don't know, feels like a little, little much for me. But we got another monk to battle, so maybe we won't have to worry about that right now. Not right away. Ooh, but it's a jester though, not a monk. Gambler, I'm a gambling man. What do you got for me? I still don't have anything to take care of. Uh, well, I have ground Doug Trio, but meh. I could just use these Pokemon just as easily and be all the better. And Swift. Ooh, Vulpix, this is the other fire Pokemon. See, the thing is, I, I'm not sure, I don't remember if I uh, mentioned this before, but with the two versions, red and blue, they both do the same like story progression, so pretty much the games are identical, except for something called exclu for exclusive Pokemon, meaning that there's some Pokemon that you can only find in red, and some that you can only find in blue. And this is the earliest that you can catch, because you could fight them in battles, but not you know, find them naturally. Uh, this is one of the examples. Vulpix, you cannot find in the red version, you can only find in the blue version, but Growlithe you can only find in the uh, red version, but not the blue version. It's They often have like those counterparts that, you know, for each version exclusive, so like, uh, they have like Growlithe, Vulpix, uh, Oddish, Bellsprout, um, bunch of other ones I'm not remembered off the top of my head uh, I think like something probably something like hmm probably like Atkins and coughing or something like that only fun couple of versions I don't remember maybe I'm just thinking of the team rocket thing I don't know but I could have swore those guys were only in certain versions but hmm oh well there'll be other ones we'll be encountering later looks like there's a route there I don't feel like cutting that open cuz I don't plan on catching anything here. I think mostly it's the same stuff we've 
had for like last route or so in there, like so your pages and stuff. But I think like there might be a couple new ones. The one I know in there that's new is you can find Growlis in there, and blue you can find Bulbixes, like I just said. So that's pretty cool, but unfortunately I already or not well. Okay, but I have Charmander, so I only really need another fire type. Let's get those criticals and be all the better for it. 31, let's go. Ah, uh, Pikachu getting stronger than ever. Let's switch to Doug Trio. I switched, I put Doug Diglett back into the PC. Oh man, that muck sprite looking pretty good. I like the huge hand, just like in the big, just rawr, like coming at you. That's pretty cool, actually. I like it. I like it. He tries to pound me. I don't think so. And critical hit. Because Doug Trio is really fast, he's going to be getting those criticals more. Yep, that's how it works in Gen 1, in case you didn't know. Generally, if your speed's higher, then you have a bit more of a chance of getting crits. Really weird, I know. But hey, it doesn't mean we can't abuse it. I wish that Dugtree had a different ground attack. This one's good power, but it's like, I, I don't like waiting to turn and stuff. And doing it, because it's kind of, I don't know, takes up time, I guess. Uh, but I, hope, I think we'll be getting some more moves down the road. Hope maybe pretty soon, who knows. We beat the super nerd. And let's see here, what we got. Well, we got, oh man, we got like a whole row of trainers. And I might just take care of them a bit, a bit later. Let's see. I was trying to see if there's an item in there, but it doesn't look like it. And that's just whatever. Oops, I hit that. Hmm. And I don't know if I can pass you without doing that. Oh, it looks like there's a thing here, though. Is it the same thing? Yep. I'm on guard duty. Gee, I'm thirsty, though. <laughs> oh, wait. There, the roads close. Yep, we can't go through still. Because uh, they're freaking thirsty. Who hired these people? I swear. Let's just battle you to get some anger out. Anger management issues. Oh, my God. Oh, man. I still haven't switched out Pikachu, but good thing I had. It's a polywag, so. Easy money. Both for the W wins and the pocket cash you get. <laughs> uh, I always liked how it was like in the Kingdom Hearts universe, it was called money with a U. Because that just screams more of just like, getting that money than Mooney. That's what it's all about. Hmm. You know, Poliwag may not be, you know, have the, as prominent lips in this version, but he's still got those uh, Kylie Jenner challenge uh, lips going. This all that all the reference also doesn't date this at all. It's like it was already okay. That was already. Why did I say that was already dated? Bef way before I started making this series, I think. Uh. Ooh, man. Polly were looking fly as hell. Looking like they just took one of the... Well, the execute eggs and just put some eyes and arms and legs on them and uh, drew a swirl on them. Basically what it looks like, and I guess painted it blue and stuff, but... His body just looks like an egg. It's not, because like, in other versions and like, official artwork and stuff, it's like a round, like a perfectly round circle. But here it's just like, nah, I'll just take an egg. That's good enough. Let's see. Ooh, man, Charmeleon, you need to freaking get some levels in. What are you doing? Get in the freaking back, Pikachu. All my Pokemon sprites look the same. Except for Pikachu, because he has to stand up, because he's an attention whore, because he, he thinks, because he got star of the anime, he gets to uh, have all the attention to himself. Just as any, uh... Up in, like just as any youtuber who starts off from the very beginning and just like is not a success now it's become a horrible sellout it's basically what Pikachu <laughs> okay I'm not okay I'm done I'm done all right that's enough of that we got Voltorbs to battle not 
trash talk other people when I have it's no business of my own. So, yeah. Okay. Ah, there we go. We caught up with those levels. Cat up. Coughing. This part might be shut cut short a little bit because there's actually not much more to this route, it looks like. But obviously there's those trainers there, which I'll, I'm gonna battle off screen, I think, because they're not as important right now, at least. So, yeah. I also have things to do today as well. My phone's ringing again. I'm going to ignore it because it's not important right now. If they want to reach me, they could freaking reach me another time. That's better. I guess I could just tell people my schedule, but I don't have a schedule for doing this uh, recording stuff, so. You know, I really wish Charmeleon would have a better freaking fire attack. But at least we get those burns. Because, yeah, those are totally helpful. We got those burns. We got those burns. My computer's running out of space. I'm just looking at my screen and just like, man. Well, I'll have to, like, do the freaking clean again clean freaking computer thing again or whatever I did I'll remember once I do it won't be a big deal it was pretty easy last time cuz remember after a few series I needed to just like get some stuff off that wasn't important so kept like the cash things and stuff so that was kind of irritating but you know what happens? Alright. Tackle me, Magneton. Tackle, tackle, tackle. Scratch. He's not steel type in this game, so it doesn't matter. Is that it? Hopefully. Yep, it is. Alright. I'm going to ignore those trainers for now. I'll battle them off to the screen some other time. Uh. But let's take a look down here. It looks like it's another underground segue. I'm just like imaging the like Batman transition, like the like you know. It's just like thought transitions. It's what you think of. Anyway, looks like we're on the outside. There's grass. Not gonna bother with it though, because okay, my D-pad's not acting up what is going on Ooh, I like this color for this new place it's like a turquoise I, I like it well guys welcome to drum roll going to the items Celadon City had to pull up the map just to prove to myself and to you guys of course that I am in fact telling the truth that it is Celadon we've reached a new city I think that's as good as time as any to call it a day. Let's get it. But not really. I'm going to like do proper introduction outro. We're going to explore the city next time and check out what we can do next. And maybe try and find out more about that silph scope. See you guys then.